the top stories. Manipur Chief Minister calls on Nirmala Sitaraman Rajnath Singh in New Delhi. Indian Medical Association Manipur chapter to suspend all non-essential services including OPD for 24 hours. And Manipur PCC Chief Gai Khangam slams Biran administration over financial crisis. Good evening and welcome to Times of Manipur. This is Suraj Khongban Tabam giving you the news. Now the news in detail. Manipur Chief Minister N. Biren Singh today called on Union Minister of Finance and Corporate Affairs Nirmala Sitharaman at her office chamber and apprise her of the present financial position of the state. Official sources said Biren also had a productive conversation with Union Defense Minister Raj Nath Singh when he called on him at his official residence this morning. Besides, facing overdraft, the Biden government is currently experiencing a critical leadership crisis with one camp of his cabinet colleagues is ostensibly trying to replace him. Notably, Deputy Chief Minister Y. Joy Kumar Singh and Minister T.H. Biswajit Singh were stripped of key portfolios a few days back. Y. Joy Kumar blamed the Chief Minister for the overdraft now facing Manipur. Minister T.H. Biswajit, on the other hand, demanded an inquiry against the Secretary in charge of Finance Department in connection with the overdraft issue. Meanwhile, speculations are doing round in the political arena that the leadership crisis within the BJP-led coalition government could further aggravate in the days to come. In the backdrop of the overdraft issue and leadership tussle, eight legislatures of the ruling party, four ministers and two MPs rushed to New Delhi yesterday. The ministers who are camping in the national capital include Nemcha Kibgen, L. Jayanta Kumar, Losi Diko and Kaisi, while the legislatures include Samuel Jendai, Vungzagin Valte, Radha Kishore, Sorokhaibam Rajan Singh, Asabuddin, Titi Haukep, S. Subhash Chandra Singh, P. Sarat Chandra Singh. The titular king of Manipur, Laisembha Sanajawa, today took to social media and condemn the present political crisis besieging the state. He termed it as not admirable considering the acute financial situation and skyrocketed price of basic commodities facing the state. He urged all the political leaders to end the political blame game in chase of power and work in the interest of the public at the earliest, else the political situation may invite presence rule in the state, he, is, he said. In solidarity of the protests against recent attack on doctor in West Bengal by a violent mob at NRS Medical College, Kolkata, Indian Medical Association Manipur State Branch will suspend all non-essential services including OPD for 24 hours from 6 a.m. of June 17 to 6 a.m. of the following day. However, emergency and casualty service and indoor patient services will remain unaffected. Addressing media persons at the Manipur Press Club today, President of Indian Medical Association, Manipur State Branch, Dr. Syam Kumar Lystrom said, ill practice of attacking medical staff or professionals in the country is increasing and therefore attention of the authority concern in the matter is the need of the hour. Taking the opportunity, Dr. Syam Kumar Lystrom also appealed to the general public not to cause harm to medical professionals. He also added that rather than be Misled by misunderstanding and creating chaos through investigation into the matter must be done first and accordingly take the recourse of law. Dr. Jingchi, what happened to the Pangam? The Kayubam Toroga, the Ain Makute at the Piraga, at the Puni Ain Lady Levaisi, Ain Namalega Devni, Dr. Sumini, Dr. Nakayubama Toran Heta, Mongot Heta Puba Copa, Mongot Heta, personal attic to Bussi, Masi, for Indian Medical Association. Headquarter na adu ke Indian Medical Association Manipur branch na su masum masi thok tena ba na koi na maya mang adu khanga na ba adu ka koi miang ke apun ba ma un na ba sum ba koi na portesi tau jo tau Taking a jab at the Chief Minister and Biden for the current financial crisis, President of Manipur Pradesh Congress Committee MPCC and member of 
Congress Working Committee Guy Kangam has accused that the Chief Minister must be aware of the huge financial transactions which were taking place in the works and power departments when the election code of conduct was in force. Any inquiry committee constituted to probe the irregularities is not trustworthy and will not serve the purpose, he said. Addressing media at his official quarters at Babupara, Guy Kangam further said, paying attention to leadership and power tussles rather than the development of the state at this crucial hour is very unfortunate. It will not only hamper growth but also affect the people in general, he said. The current financial and political imbroglios were earlier predicted by Congress Legislative Party leader and former Chief Minister Okrami Bovi. The same was also warned beforehand on the floor of the State Assembly but the government failed to pay heed. Guy Kangam further stated that it may probably be the first time in the history of the state where Reserve Bank of India directs state to seize all financial transactions, saying that it is surprised to learn that huge amount of money was withdrawn from the works and power departments while election code of conduct was in force. Guy Kangam questioned how such huge transactions were carried out without the knowledge of the chief minister. Therefore, it has now become crystal clear that huge fund was used to woo voters in the recently concluded elections. As such, prop initiated under an executive officer will not yield anything good. Instead, the irregularities should be propped by a retired judge of the High Court. Guy Kangam also asserted that according to the Article 166, Clause 3 of the Rule of mm -hmm. Business, the maximum amount a minister can withdraw is rupees 2 crore. Chief Minister has to approve the transaction if the amount is more than 2 crore. However, withdrawal of huge amount of state fund by violating the rule is not only unconstitutional but scandalous, he said. Guy Kangam drew the attention of the government to resolve and the crisis soon and focus on the development of the state. Sema Amana Aduk Sauruba scandal has a batarico. Took Sauruba put a seat. Inquiry committee a seat of Saramat of PBC. Justice Tawani have a seat has a what? Has a what? Maravandan City High Level Inquiry Tawani Yam Nungai on the Roadship Minister Lenga Casino. Sigumba, a swab of Mayama say. Must have talked on some talk, and never gonna be but attempt, I say. It's a good, very good attempt and a very welcoming attempt. Must be a young Tagani, Sashwanda, Governance, the young Akai Baba P. Must be put a maxi thereby, state key interest nutty, state key development in Tagani, state key reputation, Saturday, even Kalihani. Development the all the activities of the governance, grinding hold up. Subsa lip Adu lap pata ready. Adu kum lap piya bagi. Mami do tai hezeri ba. Adu ready. Ekhoi state se yam kuwa kada ba. Kuwa minna kada ba ko. Adu kum se. Well, it's time now for a short break. Manipur ki ahan ba 24/7 cab service ori ba lamjing ba cab service na miyangi seba da lejeri. Apamba service can be you economic red rupees 15 per kilometer, standard red rupees 25 per kilometer, luxury red rupees 55 per kilometer with best fear of rupees 40. Manipurgi district singi, Maruoina, Senapati, Ukru, Churzanpur, Kakting, Mori, Tandela Singba Sing, Tananabagisu, Ataba Mamalda, Bukto Vibayaragani. Manipurgi Mapangi Lam Sing, Haibadi, Guwahati. Silong, Dimapur, Silter Nasing Basing, Tatanabagisu Book to Biu, Loinana, Luhongba, Amadi Atopa Tabak Torongi Damaktasu, a Kanaba discount, Pizari. Hena Kupa Marongi Damak, contact to Biu, a Koyi contact number one eight zero zero one zero two seven nine five nine. Natraga eight seven nine four six one three one five four. A quickie website www.lamzingbakef.com Nauka Hearing App Center 
ไมนิปูเกียฮันบาไพรเวทแซทไลท์แชนเนลโตมทีวีไทม์สอบมณีปูร์เคเบิลทีวีเซอร์วิสอธุบมะตำดาฮาวซิรากะนีลัมซิง
ki family sing da basis to roga ayam ba yum sing si sarak pani loi na na ekoi hok jo hok jik pai khat liba ekoi ki skim si ki makha da lairi ba panchay ki thak ta pai khat pana ta na ekoi ki mla loken area development fund da ki ayam ba hok jik lairi ba sing si pai khat liba si handa ki la ka do riba ekoi ki tam si ki manung da yum chama ki mathak ta sana ba ki da makta plan ta uri the week-long summer camp at Yud Hostel Kumalampak for boys and girls concluded today. Altogether, 30 students from classes 1 to 10 who took part in the camp were given certificates of participation. Director of the camp, Suraj Guru Aribam, said the camp was held to improve overall skill development of the students, including activities which help children identify their passion and the skills they are good at. He further said, that several resource persons attended the camp and spoke on great learning benefits for child in developing social skills, developing resiliency and confidence. Summer camp to raise a game based activities may am sisina moida larik tambiba hypotene. I think you parents ki may am kino hai residential or the am the nungaini hena. Adobu akoi na matang chahi de gidi residential wain to gain akoi na kan na honari akoi na non residential to raise na akoi na Manipur na han wain summer camp zik concepts akoi na different wain akoi na toba. Adi gidi akoi na quality service pa ambani na akoi na me se campers a thirty de gidi hena lau de na hamu ki first camp to thirty one lau e adobu handa gidi thirty katang lau e adobu maina ne akoi gidi summer camp ki objectives. Bisnupur District Youth Affairs and Sports today inaugurated a coaching center for Wushu at Mangol Nganbi College at Ningthokong, where regular coaching sessions will be conducted for six months. The inaugural function was attended by T.H. Tomba, DYSAO Bisnupur, along with several office bearers of Wushu Association. Speaking on the occasion, Wushu coach of Youth Affairs and Sports and also a silver medalist at the Asian Championship, M. Ronald mentioned the main objective of opening the coaching center is to promote more national and international level Wushu players from Bisnupu district. He added the coaching center was opened as per directive of Youth Affairs and Sports Department. This initiative will lessen the hardship faced by many athletes from the district in traveling to far away Imphal for training. Ronald added, T.H. Toomba said that during the six-month coaching classes, T-shirts and refreshment will be given to the participants. He stated, the aim of the coaching center is to prepare the young players capable enough to participate in the Olympics. Altogether, 88 Wushu players from different parts of Bishnupur will be taking part in the coaching. The Kanglai Park Communist Party Military Council, KCPMC, in a press statement today said, it would like to give revolutionary salute to the people of Manipur and show respect to the media fraternity for their moral support in the outfit's continued fight against the alleged Indian colonel's, uh, colonel's forces. The outfit also thanked the All Manipur Working Journalist Union, AMJU, for extending their help and support to KCPMC. Taubul Kabui Merit Award Scholarship Committee, Taubul Bistubu District, yesterday organized the 27 meritorious prize distribution function at Taubul Kabui Primary School. Pradhan of Taubul Gram Panchayat, T.H. Nanaubi Devi, former founder president of award committee, Panmai Mangi Kabui, member of Taubul Gram Panchayat, ward number one, T.H. Gopal Singh, and former secretary of award committee, Kamsan Stethop Kabui, shared the dais at the event. Let's take a short break once again. Gidam University Visakha Patnam da BSc Nursing amadi MSc Nursing in NPCC gidamak female candidate singna admission to BB Yaragani. Campus manung da masagi hospital laizera ba medical college ni. Room amada mahiroi ani khakta maglai ba lift facility yaura ba amadi yam hygienic oira ba hostel yaura ba campus ni. MSc Nursing the admission fangla ba mahiroi singda tha khuding ki stipend oina lopal sing tarah fangani. Tuition fee structure. BSc rupees thirty thousand per year, food and accommodation rupees forty five thousand per year. First to fourth year same fees. MSc Nursing in NPCC fees rupees one point five lakh per year, food and accommodation rupees forty five thousand per year. Eligibility BSc class twelve pass physics, chemistry, biology and English sixty percent in aggregate. Manipur ki mahiroi singi oina entrance test yau dana direct admission tobi ba yagni. Sub na taki sid tarah manga khatte nai. Aku Pamarol Gidama contact to Birao Educare Zone near Bosem Babu Para phone number 6009062261 Natraga 
ฮัลโหลเฮลโหพาวปามบีทาบิโออ๋อเคจะฮิตาราอีพลานตอเกฮาร์ดีอูปามบีทาบิโอจะฮิจามุกีพลานดีอีจาบูอะพาวสคูล
President of Committee for Civil Societies, Kangrai Park Jitendra Ningomba, has strongly condemned the state political leaders for negligence and indifferent attitudes towards several burning issues like price hike of essential commodities and citizenship amendment bill. At a press meet held at the office of CCSK in New Chakon Imphal, Jitendra Ningomba urged the, all the state leaders should stop engaging in political game and concentrate on working towards development of the land and welfare of its people as promised earlier during the time of election. On the other hand, advisor of CCSK Joy Chingakham said, in this political scenario, there is a high possibility that President's rule may impose in the state. He also appealed to all the political leaders to end the crisis or else the government must be held responsible for any untoward incidents that may occur in days to come. Masine ekoi gi Manipur miam singi Manipur de leri ba miam sing tam ani makbulaga ekoi gi law bu mukoi gi wakalun miam sing se ngasi committee of civil society kangi pak C C S ki gi na mot se laga miam dahai bani aduna hujik se Manipur gi da mukte lepi ro Manipur gi swere kada ba Manipur miam na ya da ba pocho tawirano Manipur miam gi da mukta man na koi na boatu law gi ba boat le bata law gi ba koi gi Manipur miam nungai hen gani ada karu ta hen gani hai ba pocho madu da lepi ro hai dina C C S ki gi ma kiti gi law jeli. A 15-day training on jute items for women organized by Rural Education Development Institute Redi under the Director of Social Welfare Government of Assam has concluded at Saram Khun Rongpur Silchar. President of All Assam, Maira Pai Bilup Assam, Ampal A. Lili Singha attended the event as Chief Guest, Jilla Parishad of Udarbon Beliara Begum, Prilaskar as President and Tomzi Udin Laskar, Nurul Huda Laskar as Guest of Honor. Secretary of Redi Seram Herajit said the Jew training program was held to empower women, give them skill training to generate self-income, generate employability and sustain earnings by making Jew items. As part of the program, certificates were presented to 30 women participants. <laughs> A number of Hakta, marketing gi, Matin Pamani Havasi, who enjoy Makedigi, Hazabatam. Preparations for Ambubachi Mela are going on in Assam city in full swing. Ambubachi Mela, also known as Ambubasi Festival, is held annually during monsoon in the Kamakya Devi Temple at Guwahati, Assam. We have a report on this. The Ambubachi Mela is celebrated in the capital city of Guwahati in the northeastern state of Assam in India. The Ambubachi Mela is the most important festival of the Kamakya Temple of Guwahati. The Ambubachi is a ritual of assessors observed with tantric means. It is believed that the presiding goddess of the temple, Devi Kamakya, the Mother Shakti, goes through her annual cycle of menstruation during this time stretch. दरअसल क्या होता है लड़की लोग का जो मेंच होता है ना वो देवी का भी साल में एक बार होता है ये परंपरा है वो पीढ़ी दर ये कितना साल से हो रहा है हमको भी याद मतलब पता नहीं होगा हम तो हमारा एज कितना है उस हिसाब से हमारा इस दर में पूर्वज जो था कम से कम थाउजेंड साल पहले का बात है अम्बुवासी महायुग के लिए सबको शुभकामनाएँ और सबको हमारे हमारे तरफ से धन्यवाद during the Ambubachi Mela in Guwahati, the doors of the Kamakat Temple remain closed for three days. It is believed that the Mother Earth becomes unclean for three days. During this time, any kind of farming work is not taken on. Daily worships and other religious performances are also stopped during the Ambubachi Mela of Guwahati in Assam. After the completion of three days, the doors of the Kamakya temple are reopened. But the doors of the temple are reopened only after the Devi Kamakya is bathed and the other rituals are executed. It is then believed that the Mother Earth has retrieved her purity. This is purely a ritual of the Tantric cult. We have a lot of good feelings. We have a lot of support. We have a lot of support. 
जो पिलग्रिम्स सब आते हैं और अभी अंबुबाची मेले में देश विदेश से इतने सब आए हैं और इतना ही हम चाहेंगे कि माँ सबका भला करे सबके ऊपर माँ की कृपा बरसती रहे और माँ का आशीर्वाद हर हम में हम सब प्रदेश और देशवासियों के साथ रहे और विश्व बंधुत्व की भावना जो है वो सब हम माँ हमको ऐसा आशीर्वचन दे कि हम पूरे देशवासी सब एक होकर रहे और विश्व बंधुत्व की भावना रहे द अम्बुबाची मेला इन गुवाहाटी इज हेल्थ एट द कमख्या टेम्पल आफ्टर बिंग क्लोज फॉर द मैं थ्री डेज ऑन द फोर्थ डे The devotees of the goddess are allowed to enter the temple for worshiping Devi Kamakya. Thousands of pilgrims are found to visit the Ambubachi Mela in Guwahati, who comes all over India. It is celebrated for three days during the monsoon. It is believed that the presiding goddess of the temple, Devi Kamakya, the Mother Shakti, goes through her annual cycle of. menstruations during this time straits thousands of pilgrims are visiting the ambubaji mela in guwahati who comes all over india cameraman kesam manglem with hamanta morangtham times of manipur guwahati let's now have the top stories of today's newspaper headlines The Songhai Express All ministers including CM now camping at New Delhi Conflicts erupt among coalition partners Chief Minister should be held responsible says CPI Indian Medical Association launches 3 days nationwide strike Pan India dogs go on day long protest in solidarity with Kolkata Medicos Grim state even if overdraft clear The People's Chronicle Chief Minister meets Pralad Rizizu State Ministers MLA Strong Delhi India Myanmar meets proposes FEC at Moray Youth hurt in stone felting in Nagaland Political leaders blame for state's backwardness Infall free press Crisis within BJP led government aggravates Agrief ministers MLA rushes to Delhi CPI demands inquiry against CM Biran Central government must honor culture tradition of indigenous people Jay Guevara remember on 91st birth anniversary the morning bell political crisis in Manipur defense minister biswasit three npp ministers ruling mls ministers rush to new delhi cpi demands inquiry against cm biran other ministers instead of a drop issue npp ministers will follow decision of high command says jayendra kumar manipur mail manipur crisis and resolve most leaders rush to delhi Sahitya Academy awards for Zitan and Sanahan B. Bamboo an alternative to Zoom says Shyam Kumar. Meghalaya government encourages by public participation says Conrad. Before we wind up let's have a quick look at the top stories once again. Manipur chief minister calls on Nirmala Sitaraman Rajnath Singh in New Delhi Indian Medical Association Manipur chapter to suspend all non essential services including OPD for 24 hours Manipur's PCC chief Gai Khangam slams Biran administration over financial crisis. Well, that's all for now. Keep watching Times of Manipur.